It was important to do the ignition on the Boundary Lake fire in order to straighten out the control lines in anticipation of a 180 degree wind switch in the coming days. My name is Chris Worrell. I'm an ignition specialist trainee up on the North Peace Complex. When we're doing our burn plans, we're looking to achieve certain objectives, generally bringing fire back to containment lines and making things much safer for crews to work from. The crew's role on the ground is to support aerial ignitions. The aerial ignition does the large chunk of the work and the crews are just bringing the fire to the guard and kind of keeping the intensity down um, and allowing the fire just to die out when it re reaches our control line. Ignition in this fuel type is a very useful tactic for us with it being the more flashy fuels and wind driven so we're able to remove the fuels between the control lines and the fire itself making conditions safer for crews. This was kind of the last piece uh, of unsecured edge so going forward it's going to be more patrols um, using infrared scanning to find hot spots and seek and destroy and so three to five days more just ensuring we have a secured perimeter.